there's just thousands of eggs all over the place. So it's, it's sad. Betty Gonzalez photographs wildlife in her free time. She's always had a soft spot for turtles and used to volunteer with the park service at Playlanda Beach caring for them. So she was devastated the first time she went out after Hurricane Ian passed through and saw this. It's so sad. You know, there's nothing you can do. And, th and then when you see them and you think, oh, okay, you know, these are going to make it. And then you come the next day and they've just been washed even more. It's, it's, it's not fun. <laughs> she says the eggs she saw were mostly from green turtles. She didn't see any loggerheads. She explained green turtles typically hatch later in the year. What was going through your head as you were walking by and saw just how many of them there were? It's just sad. I mean, you know, I mean, I know that there's, there's so much destruction on the West Coast that's way worse than what we're experiencing, but still it's just, you know, I love turtles and to see that many eggs, it's just, it's just so sad. She isn't sure what a loss like this will do to the population overall, but is worried about the damage to the eggs and the dunes. I've seen it before, but never this, you know, this is this bad. It's just never fun to see that many sea turtle eggs. Marie Edinger, Fox 35 News.